Hello Capricorn, this is your daily for the 11th through the 12th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and a card just jumped out here that we will take. All right guys, so just keep in mind that whatever I say, you know, energies can be interchangeable. Somebody else's energy could be in yours. So just listen to the message and take what resonates for you guys, okay? So we have the inner voice. Thank you, angels, for guiding me through my inner voice. That is your inner knowing, your intuition, you guys. So let's see what's going on with my Cappies for today. What's going on with my Capricorns? Ooh. Hmm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Huh. A lot of you guys are feeling hmm, guarded because there is something that is very disappointing to you currently. Okay? And I feel like you're disappointed in somebody that rejected you. And so you're no longer open to anything right now, I feel. Like you're blocking lots of things, lots of people. Um, possibly removing yourself from situations even. And you're doing this to protect yourself. But, you know... I, I just don't want you guys to be like shut in and removing yourself from everyone because when you're hurt like this and I don't know what this hurt is so I'm just gonna go ahead and you are the first sign that I've done this for and pull some cards let's see why is this broken why is Capricorn brokenhearted what is this what is this three of swords for hmm Maybe somebody cheated on you guys. Either somebody cheated on you or you feel like they cheated on you. Or you were really wanting to reunite with someone in the past and it did not happen. It did not happen. What is this Three of Cups for? Why is this Three of Cups here? Hmm. I feel like a lot of you were felt like you were carrying um, were carrying a relationship by yourself. Like, no matter what you did, the other person, it was like you just could not do enough, or they did they took you for granted. That you were the one that was always putting, like putting in the effort, trying to keep things running smoothly here. And somebody else, whoever the other person was that you are um, thinking about here, they, they just were not in it to win it. They were not in it to win it. And so, you know, you're just broken hearted about this whole situation. And basically, like, why are why am I here? Why am I here? You feel like, you know, this person was not there for you through thick and thin. They rejected you. There was not an equal exchange in this connection. Let's see why this is happening. Why you're in this situation right now. Hmm. Yeah. There's still a lot that you don't know. There's still a lot that you don't know. Um, some Somebody just basically just shat on, you know, the love that you have for them. Okay. They did not reveal how they, they truly felt for you. They were, they were really like this lazy lover. This lazy partner. And then they walk away. On top of it. 
because I get the feeling that you guys probably would not have left them. You just wanted to fix these issues here. You were willing to bear the burden of being with this person. And then they walk away is what I'm getting here. Hmm. I think you put your foot down with this person about how they were behaving. And instead of like changing that behavior, they left. Wow. I'm sorry, guys. Let's see what the outside influence is here. You're confused on how to put this to bed. You're tired of feeling this way. You're really tired of feeling this way. You want change. You want to see change in your life. You want options. You want to know what to do. Where do you go from here? Where do you go from here? But I tell you what, guys. The person that left, <laughs> they're rethinking their action to walk away as well. Being that you've blocked them, they're not sure what you're doing. They feel like, you know, you've got somebody else. Um, there's probably something about you, too, that either they've seen or they, they've heard that alludes to the fact that you guys have changed. That you're no longer willing to accept this nonsense from them. Okay. Scorpio energy. Let's see what the <clears throat> advice is for you guys. Love yourself. <laughs> Love yourself. Do what's best for you. Do what's best for you. Pick one of these cups. Pick all of these cups if that's what's best for you. But the bottom line is the main cup is to love yourself. Get your self-confidence up. Love yourself, guys. I know this is hurtful, but um, you, you will get through this. You will get through this. And like I said, this person wants to come back here because we have the seven of cups right here. And we have this one cup, which makes the eight of cups. This person, it knows they have effed up and they want to come back. All right. So my Capricorn friends, that's what I have for you guys. And I will be speaking with you soon. I will call out some signs for you. Pisces, Leo, Taurus. Um, I already said Scorpio. We have Cancer energy here. Aquarius. All right, guys. Doesn't have to be those signs, but that's the energy that's present. Talk to you soon.